It's a pretty common misconception that the stronger a move is, the further Luma will be knocked away. But that's not always the case. So after testing out 1,102 moves, I'll now be covering the most effective moves and combos for every character when it comes to getting rid of this pesky little star. I'm gonna be covering a lot, so I've left timestamps in the description if you want to skip to a specific character. Because I don't want to repeat this constantly throughout the video, let's first cover some important properties and things you should look out for when dealing with Luma. Even though you can't see it, Luma has 50 HP in total. Once it reaches 0, it will pop out of existence for about 13 seconds, at which point it responds. When Luma gets hit, it will either stay stationary or get knocked away. This depends on the move and how much HP Luma has. The less HP it has, the more it's prone to getting launched. During this tumble animation, Luma cannot move or be controlled by Rosalina until it touches the ground, meaning if it tumbles off stage, it's automatically dead. When Rosalina is in hit stun, even though Luma isn't, she can control Luma for about the first 80% of it, which gives you enough time to get a free hit in at higher percents. When Rosalina upbees while Luma is with her, it is extremely vulnerable. Luma gets no invincibility frames when Rosalina snaps to the ledge, and it cannot attack, meaning you can get a free kill on Luma if you time your move right. I'll be mentioning what moves are the best for doing this with each character. If she doesn't snap to the ledge, punish her on stage. If she doesn't call Luma back, go straight for Luma. I'm only going to be choosing the best one or two moves from each character. Here are my criteria for what's considered to be the best moves. 1. The move must be able to knock Luma away even when it's at full HP, and be able to launch it at a decent distance as well. Remember that these are just the best moves on paper. Another move could be better in a certain situation, or one that suits your playstyle more. Which is why I'll also include other moves that can launch Luma at full HP in text as well. 2. The move must be as safe as possible, meaning if Rosalina blocks your attack, the punishment is minimal. These are usually moves with disjointed hitboxes, or moves with little lag. 3. The range of the attack. These are moves with hitboxes that come out fast and travels a good distance. Moves with bad range are usually harder to land due to Rosalina's amazing zoning ability. 4. Priority. Moves with lower priority will usually get beaten out by Luma's attacks. Moves with higher priority or disjointed hitboxes can cut through most of Luma's attacks, which is what we want. 5. Throws. Certain throws have hitboxes that can launch Luma, but the throw must also be safe enough to negate Luma's attacks. On top of all this, I'll also be showcasing some efficient combos that can quickly carry Luma offstage. Since Luma can't DI or be controlled during hit stun, comboing it is really easy. As I've mentioned, if Rosalina blocks your attack, you'll still take out Luma, but will probably be punished. So the majority of these combos will be better if Rosalina is hit as well. Either that, or she's far away from Luma. Alright, with all that explained, I'll be covering the characters in alphabetical order, starting with Bayonetta. Her best move is down air. It launches Luma the farthest out of all her moves. Here are the other moves that can launch Luma as well. For edgeguarding Luma, use side B. Nice combo starters that can lead into down air are up tilt, down tilt, up B into a down air, and forward throw into a down air. Next, Bowser. His best move is up B, Whirling Fortress. This move comes out fast and it can be done out of shield which makes it useful in a lot of situations. Here are other moves that work too. As for edgeguarding Luma, use down B. A nice combo setup is up tilt into up B. Next, Bowser Jr. There are two very effective moves that hit Luma away. First is dash attack, because it's a moving hitbox. Second is multi jabs, because it comes out fast. Here are other moves that work as well. Use the Mecha Koopa for edgeguarding Luma. Captain Falcon's best move is multi jabs, since it knocks Luma away the farthest. Sometimes you might want to just settle for triple jabs instead, since multi jabs may take too long. Here are other moves that work. For edgeguarding Luma, use neutral air. A couple good combos are dash attack in the knee and a standing forward throw in the jabs. Charizard's best move is side B, Flare Blitz. The reasons are pretty obvious, it has incredible range, hits Luma far away and has a lot of priority. Dash attack is also good since the move comes out fast. Here are other moves that work. For edgeguarding Luma, use back air. Cloud's best move is dash attack. It's worthwhile to mention the edge of his upbeat knocks Luma away super far. Here are other moves that work. Korin's best move is side B, Dragon Lunge, mainly because of the range. He has all these other moves that work, but they don't launch Luma very far. Back air is good for edge guarding Luma. As for combo setups, counter into back air. Dark Pit's best move by far is side B, Electroshock Arm. It has decent range and speed, and it can be done in the air. Here are other moves that work. 
For edge guarding Luma, use side B or neutral air. As for combo setups, Dark Pit has quite a few. Dash tack in the side B. Up tilt in the side B. Down tilt to side B. Short hop neutral air into side B. And finally, three jabs to side B. Diddy's best move is side B, monkey flip. It comes out fast and can still hit Luma away even when he grabs instead of kicks. Here are other moves that work. Use up air for edge guarding Luma. Donkey Kong's best move is dash attack since it comes out fast and hits the farthest. These are other moves that work. As for edge guarding Luma, use forward air. Dr. Mario's best move by far is down B, Dr. Tornado. It hits very far, comes out fast, and is a moving hitbox. Back throw is also very effective if you ever land a grab on Rosalina. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use down air. Duck Hunt's best move is dash attack. It comes out fast and has decent range. Here are other moves that work. Up air is good for edge guarding Luma. Falco's best move is forward air, because it's an aerial with multiple hitboxes, which makes it easier to catch Luma in the air. Another noteworthy move is forward throw. This is Luma very far. Here are other moves that work. Forward air is his best for edge guarding Luma. Next up, we have Fox. Unfortunately, he has nothing that can knock Luma away when it has full HP, except for up smash and dash attack. But both of these moves knock Luma only a very small distance. Game & Watch's best move is dash attack. It comes out fast and knocks Luma pretty far. Another noteworthy move is multi jabs. Here are other moves that work. Neutral air and up B are both great for edge guard and Luma. Ganondorf's best move is down B, Wizard's Foot. This doesn't hit Luma too far, but because of how fast it comes out and the range it has, I definitely put it in number one. Back air is also good. Here are other moves that work as well. For edge guarding Luma, use back air. Greninja's best move is dash attack because it comes out fast and it hits Luma the farthest. One thing to note is that the very edge of Greninja's toe will miss, so make sure you hit with his leg. Here are other moves that work. Use back air for edge guarding Luma. A good combo is dash attack into back air. Ike's best move is dash attack. It comes out fast, and the sword's disjointed hitbox definitely makes it a bit safer. Here are other moves that work. Neutral B can reach below the stage, which is great for edge guarding Luma. Jigglypuff unfortunately has nothing noteworthy. The only moves that put full health Luma in tumble are side B and rest, both of which aren't worth going for given the trajectory and distance it launches Luma. King Dedede's best move is down tilt. The move comes out really fast, and can combo into another down tilt, or forward tilt. Here are other moves that work as well. Up air and back air are good for edge guarding Luma. Kirby's best move is dash attack. It comes out fast and has multiple hits. Multi jabs is also noteworthy since it hits far. Here are other moves that work. Kirby can charge his side B for edge guarding Luma. A great combo with Kirby is down air and the jabs. Link's best move by far is dash attack. It hits Luma very far, and the disjointed hitbox is definitely a plus. If Luma is in the air, back airs can take it out the fastest. Here are other moves that work. His best move for edge guarding Luma is back air. Little Mac's best move by far is dash attack, cause it comes out really fast and sends Luma pretty far. Forward smash can be useful as well because of the super armor. Here are other moves that work. If you manage to land a grab, do an up throw, dash dance backwards into a dash attack. Lucario has a few good moves. The best one would be forward air since you can combo into more of them and potentially carry Luma off. Dash attack is good too since it's fast. If you land a grab, do an up throw, cause it launches Luma the farthest. Here are other moves that work. Down air is his best for edge guarding Luma. Lucario's got a few great combos. Dash attack can combo into another dash attack. Also, up throw, dash attack, into forward airs. Lucas's best move is the late part of his dash attack. If you land the early part, it can combo into a down smash. Here are other moves that work. Our charge down smash is really good for edge guarding Luma, since it can reach under the stage. Lucina's best move is forward smash. It sends Luma far. The drawback is the move comes out kind of slow. Her up B is a great out of shield option to kill Luma. But of course, if Rosalina shields it, you'll get hard punished. And here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use neutral air. Luigi's best move is jabs. Doesn't have range, but it comes out fast. Here are other moves that work as well. For edge guarding Luma, use rising down B. Mario only has a few moves that can knock Luma away. His best one is up B, super jump punch. It comes out fast and can be done out of shield. Down air into up B works pretty well. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use down air. Marth's best move is dash attack. Other notable moves are forward smash, since it hits Luma super far and has a disjointed hitbox. Up B is a very good option out of shield to eliminate Luma. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use neutral air. 
A combo Marth can do is up tilt and do a tipper forward smash. Mega Man's best move is down tilt since it comes out and travels fast. The knockback is also decent. Here are other moves that work as well. Back air is his best for edgeguarding Luma. Mewtwo's best move is either multi jabs or dash attack. Multi jabs because it hits the farthest. Dash attack because it's more practical to approach with. The only other move that works is forward air. Meta Knight in my opinion is the best for dealing with not only Luma but Rosalina as well. His two best moves for taking out Luma is either forward tilt or his side B, Drill Rush. Drill Rush is a sure way of taking out Luma in many situations since it literally drags it off stage. Forward tilt is a great move as well since it's fast and launches far. Here are all the other moves that work as well. For edge guarding Luma, use forward air. A couple combos is dash attack and forward air. If you manage to land a grab, always go for an up throw if Luma is close. Me Fighter's best move is dash attack. Down B can also be useful since it travels high, which can potentially bypass Luma's zoning. Here are other moves that work as well. Me Sword Fighter's best move is side B, airborne assault. It can be charged, has good range, speed, and hits Luma far. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use forward air. Me Gunner's best move is forward smash. Although it comes out kind of slow, it does have decent range with a disjointed hitbox. Here are other moves that work. Use up B for edge guarding Luma. Ness doesn't have many moves that work, but his best one is forward smash. It doesn't come out too fast, but it does launch very far. His only other move is down smash. For edge guarding Luma, use Peaky Thunder. Olimar only has one move that works when Luma is at full health, a close up forward smash. Pac-Man's best move is the last hit of his dash attack, cause it sends Luma the farthest, plus the notoriously short end lag it has, making it hard to punish. His side B can be useful too, since it can go in many directions. Here are other moves that work. Palutena doesn't have many moves. Her best one is multi-jabs. The only other move is forward smash. For edge guarding Luma, use up air. Peach has a few really good moves. Her best one is probably side B, Peach Bomber. She bounces backwards after, making it really safe. Forward air is also really good, cause she can do it out of her float, and she has a lot of control over how far it goes. The racket and the golf club from her forward smash launches Luma the farthest. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use up air. A combo she has is short hop down air into a double jump forward air. Pikachu's best move is either forward air or dash attack. Both moves comes out really fast. Dash attack can also nicely combo into a forward air. Here are other moves that work. Back air is the most effective for edge guarding Luma. Pit's best move is dash attack, cause the move comes out fast. Here are other moves that work. He has a few good ways to combo Luma. First is down tilt into dash attack, and up tilt into neutral air. Rob's best move is side B, arm rotor, mainly cause he can control the movement and it has many hitboxes. Here are other moves that work. As for edge guarding Luma, use neutral air. A couple combos he's got is neutral air to forward smash, and dash attack to down smash. Robin has a lot of moves that work. Two of the best are Dash Attack and Arc Thunder. Dash Attack comes out fast and knocks Luma pretty far. Being a projectile, Arc Thunder can reach Luma from far away, but at the same time, if Rosalina is close by, it can get absorbed. Here are other moves that work. Use Back Air for edge guarding Luma. Rosalina herself can actually kill Luma pretty efficiently, mostly due to the fact that Luma itself is the best disjointed hitbox in the game. Her best move is probably Multi Jabs since it comes out very fast. Dash attack is also really good since it can combo into a forward air. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use up air. Roy's best move is dash attack cause it comes out fast and launches Luma pretty far. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use up B. Some combos are falling neutral air into a dash attack and forward air into a dash attack. Ryu's best move is dash attack since it launches Luma pretty far. Manual input side special is also good because of its high priority. For an aerial approach, forward air is the best. Here are other moves that work. Use forward air for edge guarding Luma. Samus's best move is dash attack. By itself it doesn't do much, but the fact that you can true combo into a full jump forward air makes it the best. Here are other moves that work. Her back air is good for edge guarding Luma. Another combo that she can do is down tilt into a forward air. Sheik's best move is dash attack, cause it comes out really fast and has decent range. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use up air. A good combo is dash attack into forward airs. If Rosalina is far away, you can potentially carry Luma off stage with it. Shulk's best move is dash attack, because of the speed and range. Another noteworthy move is the second hit of up B. Here are other moves that work. An up tilt into forward air is a solid combo. Sonic's best move is forward air. Here are other moves that work. 
Use forward air for edge guarding Luma. If you land a grab, up throw into a forward air. Toon Link doesn't have many moves that can get Luma at full HP. Forward smash is his best. Besides that, it's up throw. As for edge guarding Luma, use forward air. Villager's best move is a close forward air or back air. Although the range is very short, forward smash launches Luma the farthest. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use back air. A couple of good combos is up tilt into forward smash. If Luma is by itself, ride Lloyd Rocket into a down air. Wario's best move by far is riding his bike, because it travels far and fast, plus he can control the speed. Here are other moves that work. Down air is his best for edge guarding Luma. We Fit Trainer's best move is forward tilt. Here are other moves that work. Back air and up air are both useful for edge guarding Luma. Dash attack can combo into another dash attack or forward tilt. Yoshi only has two moves that can launch Luma at full health, forward smash and dash attack. I'd say dash attack is better since it comes out fast and travels fast. Back air is his best for edge guarding Luma. Zelda's best move is dash attack. It hits Luma very far. Here are other moves that work. For edge guarding Luma, use neutral air. A combo to get rid of Luma is up tilt into a forward smash. Zero Suit Samus has a few great moves. Dash attack, up B, and down air. Here are the other moves that work. Back air is her best for edge guarding Luma. Dash attack can combo into her aerials. Well, that about covers it. Hopefully this video will help you out with the Rosalina matchup. For you new viewers, if you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon.